right here then. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the movie stars whose faces do all the talking. You've got a big surprise coming to you. <laughs> Number 10, Tom Hanks. Few actors could craft a believable relationship with a volleyball. Okay, here we go, Wilson. You don't have to worry about anything. I'll do all the paddling. You just hang on. This Oscar-winning Forrest Gump actor's face is so distinctive, the computer scientist at the University of Washington used his face as a model for 3D face reconstruction technology. Is, is he smart? He's very smart. He's one of the smartest in his class. Now, this may be a little creepy from an ethical standpoint, but if anything, it's a testament to Hank's ability to show a wide range of emotion with the slightest movements. Whether it's an upbeat comedy or a survivalist thriller, Hank's can do more with a raising of the eyebrows than most can do with their whole face. Let me see it really quick. Can you lift up your arm a little bit? Does that hurt? A little bit? A little bit. Okay. Is it tender? Go ahead and put your arm down. Okay, I need you to look at me. I need you to calm down. I need you to breathe. Number nine, Emma Stone. Because maybe I'm not good enough. Yes, you are. No. No, maybe I'm not. Yes, you are. Maybe I'm not. You are. Maybe I'm not. You are. It's not just her trademark red hair and green eyes that make Emma Stone a luminous screen presence. The Academy Award winner's big eyes leave an impression on the screen, but her entire face is so malleable that she can be expressive in almost any genre. You're doing this because you're scared to death, like the rest of us, that you don't matter. And you know what? You're right. You don't. It's not important, okay? You're not important. Get used to it. She's put her versatile style to use in a range of roles in rip-roaring comedies, hard-hitting dramas, and even a musical. Though she's clocked her go-to teary cry smile as one of her acting shticks, she's got a lot more in her arsenal than that. Although, honestly, the teary cry smile gets us every time. You need some time to figure out how you feel about this, okay? <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. <clears throat> wow. <gasps> Number eight, Helena Bonham Carter. We could have a life, us two. Maybe not like I dreamed. Maybe not like you remember. But we could get by. Featured in many films created by Tim Burton, this haunting British actress's sharply etched cheekbones and deep-set eyes give her the appearance of a time-travelling Victorian woman. She can look hurt and vulnerable just as easily as she can seem evil and deranged. I love a warm pig belly for my aching feet. Would you like one, um? No, thank you. As with many actors, so much of this comes from the eyes. But the thing that always sets her apart is how she can also convey a knowing twinkle of wicked humour. Even some of her cruelest characters have a streak of good humour to them. It adds complexity to her characters that make them much harder to read. Very strange time in my life. Number seven, Robert Downey Jr. And I am. Tony Stark may be his most famous character, but that's definitely one of the more stoic performances Robert Downey Jr. has given. And you don't have to dig very deep into his filmography to see that he's an economical actor when it comes to his expressions. But subtle doesn't mean invisible. And hey Kevin, you're here, Lestrade. I'd almost run out of jokes. You know, in another life, you'd have made an excellent criminal. There are few actors who can be spellbinding to watch even when they're just listening. Let's not forget either that one of his breakthrough roles was as Charles Chaplin, the master of silent comedy himself. 
Even the scenes where he's acting behind a face full of prosthetic age makeup are stunning. Number six, Johnny Depp. Well, then why'd you do it? Because you asked me to. Some of this actor's strongest work to date is in a role that requires no dialogue. In Edward Scissorhands, it isn't just his silence that puts him in line with great silent film actors. His gaze strikes the camera and pulls you in. What's most surprising about Johnny Depp is how low-key he is off-screen. He's not an incredibly expressive guy. You are without doubt the worst pirate I've ever heard of. But you have heard of me. Truly, it seems like he saves himself for the camera. When he turns it on, he can brood like James Dean, pull as many faces as Jim Carrey, and he can even haunt the screen like a silent horror villain. They all deserve to die. Tell you why. Number five, Nicolas Cage. Look, he's generated more memes than almost any other actor, and that has to be worth something. I never misspelled anything! Not once, not one time! Whether it's in one of his acclaimed roles or in a movie that has a small but loyal fan base, Nicolas Cage can be trusted to provide endless entertainment. A large part of that is the way he uses his distinctive and intense face. My leg hurts. I wonder if it's cancer. There's a bump. I'm starting to sweat. Stop sweating. I've got to stop sweating. Can she see it dripping down my forehead? No matter what emotion he's trying to convey, there's always a great big heaping dose of it. Where some actors go for subtlety, Cage tends to be fully committed to giving us our money's worth. His wild eye ferocity is sometimes funny, sometimes scary, but it's never boring. How to get burned? How to get burned? I, How to get burned? How to get burned? I don't know! Number four, Angela Bassett. I'll give up all that other stuff, but only if I get to keep my name. I work too hard for it. You're right. Actress and host Kiki Palmer knows the secret behind this legendary actress's mastery of face acting. According to Palmer, it's all in the lips. It's true that Angela Bassett is an unforgettable actor when it comes to pain and anguish. And now that I've done that, I'm ready. I'm ready and I know what I want. But even when she's playing in Light Affair, like how Stella got her groove back, her smolder puts her on par with the great screen romantic leads. The fact is, no matter what character she plays, Bassett commands our attention. Her expressions can run the gamut, but she's at her best when her face is betraying what she so badly wants to say. Not because of the dangerous potential of vibranium, but because of the dangerous potential of you. Number three, Meryl Streep. Could be back. He never wrote to me, he never called me. Well, maybe you were out. Yeah, maybe. She has a once-in-a-generation talent, and so much of her impact is due to the special care she pays in crafting the external life of her characters. It's not that she doesn't do the internal work, it's just that she disappears into them so completely that the character and the performer become one and the same. This is probably Meryl Streep's greatest weapon. No, oh, don't be ridiculous, Andrea. Everybody wants this. Everybody wants to be us. Just using her face, she charts her character's emotions and guides us through them without it ever feeling like too much. She can shift into new gears and discoveries all in the same close-up, letting her character's realizations and moods play out organically. How do I look? Terrific. 
Number two, Jack Nicholson. Are you soft, Fitz? When I tell you to dump a body in the marsh. Those arched eyebrows and that curling smile are the stuff of cinematic dreams and also some nightmares. Over the top though they might be at times, Jack Nicholson's severe facial expressions are so baked into his performances that it's hard to imagine him without them. They're part of the reason Nicholson is such a draw. No, Mr. McMurphy. When the meeting was adjourned, the vote was nine to nine. Ah, oh, come on, you're not gonna say that now, you're not gonna say that now! His face is just as effective when he doesn't move it at all. The actor is blessed with a naturally surly expression that somehow works no matter what kind of character he's playing. Even his comedy characters have a touch of menace to them. But when he plays a villain, his natural expressions are downright chilling. I don't think that's true. I think you have some very definite ideas about what should be done with Danny, and I'd like to know what they are. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Jim Carrey The color of this pen is red. There are 42 individual muscles in the human face. Jim Carrey seems to have complete control of every single one of them. Since the beginning of his career, his somewhat uncanny ability to manipulate his face and completely change appearance has been a huge part of his persona. Boom! Somebody stop me! Changing his natural features to match actors like Jack Nicholson and Clint Eastwood was an early staple of his stand-up act. However, his command over his face isn't just a comic effect. One of the reasons he's so believable in dramas is because that control also means he can dial it back and project emotions with just a few well-chosen movements. In case I don't see ya. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Which of these actors could you watch on mute? Let us know in the comments. The pen is blue. The pen is blue! The goddamn pen is blue! Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.